From the rainforests of Thailand to the boreal forests of Siberia, trees combat climate change by pulling carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere as they grow. In addition to regulating the climate, forests also nurture biodiversity. But today, their ability to provide these benefits is waning. Trees evolved over millions of years to withstand fire, drought, insects, disease. But even resilience has its limits. Extreme drought, combined with other stressors, can turn insect infestations deadly, slaying mighty hemlocks and pines in North America. And the lack of moisture can transform a tree into a tinderbox. In the far north, drought and fire plague the boreal forests of Canada, Siberia, and Alaska. These forests normally trap vast amounts of carbon, but now warmer summers are shutting the trees down, reducing photosynthesis. Intense wildfires are clearing the land, allowing new tree species to replace those that have burned. In the tropics, the pressure to clear trees for agriculture, grazing, and mining has fragmented vast tracts of rainforest, compromising biodiversity. The health of the planet depends on the health of its forests. But today, only a fraction of forests remain undisturbed by humans. Still, some scientists and policymakers think that degraded and secondary forests will be a vital source of forest cover in the future. And others say we need a comprehensive forest health care plan for the 21st century. It will require more than just protecting old growth forests. It also will require rehabilitating disturbed and recovering forests. <laughs>